Hello there YouTube, it's Tech Savage Pro here and today I'm going to be showing you how to get a dark mode UI or user interface for your home screen on iOS 10 through iOS 10.3.2 and up all the way up to iOS 11 and what you need to do is you need to go to the website that I'm going to leave you to, the link to in the description below and once you get there you'll be prompted with this type of interface and once you're there you want to go and click on these three little bars and you should see an X right there once you're there you want to click the very first one which will be home and then you want to scroll down you should see all free keep scrolling and then you should be right here once you see that type of image you want to click on hide dock wallpapers and if you want a dark mode, you want to click on the magic white. And you'll see why we're going to do the white one later on in the video. But once you click on the white one, you want to find the one that you need or based on your device. Like this one right here is for the iPhone 7, 6S, 6, SE, 5S, 5C, 5, or iPod Touch 6. And the other one is for the plus models. And then the classic is for just any standard device that's running iOS 9.2 or below. And mine would be the very first one, so I'm going to click on that one. Once you click on it, you need to be aware that once you click on this, it's going to bring you to a different page and you won't be able to see anything even if you hold you can see the full wallpaper but what you want to do is you want to click the share button at the bottom of your browser right there and then scroll over and click save image or you, if you have a 3d touch compatible device you can just 3d touch on it and then click save image now you want to go to your photos and before you go to your photos, you want to make sure that um, low power is disabled or low power mode. So go to your battery and make sure that low power mode is disabled because if it isn't, this will not work correctly and it will not follow the procedure that it should. So once you make sure that that's disabled, you want to go into photos click on your image and then you want to click the share button you want to click use as wallpaper now you can either click as set as both or set as home screen but this really doesn't have an effect on the lock screen as far as I know besides it will make it kind of a more dark mode for you but for video purposes I'm just gonna do set as home screen and once you've done that you should see that there is no dock like let me show you what I mean so if I go and I set a different image hang on let's do let's do this one okay so like if I go and I set this image you see I have a dock. I have that little gradient type box that keeps my four applications that are stock in place. And if I set the other one, then that gradient type effect will be gone. As you can see but you want to know how to get the dark mode so what you want to do once you've made sure that you've set the magic white wallpaper properly and there is no dock then you want to go into settings click general go into accessibility and then click a split display accommodations so it's right here right above speech click it and then you should see invert colors once you see that 
toggle that on and then it'll look just like this and you can tell that it's a sort of a dark mode type interface and all your apps will have this dark mode type effect to them now some people don't really like this but personally if it's just a standard solid color wallpaper in the background and there's not a dock then it's perfectly fine but if you have a wallpaper with a whole bunch of vivid colors and stuff then it's going to be hard to use because the colors are going to mess and trip with your eyes it's going to be really stressful on your eyes so if you do do this make sure that it's just a solid wall wallpaper and you should be fine but this has been tech savage pro here and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and please share this video on social media and i'll see you in the next one peace out